Hello guys, in this lesson I will show you how to create custom directive inside blade template. As you see here, I am listing some posts and I am check if a post is matching with the current authenticated user, show this update button. Let me show you the result. Currently I am logged in as Laravel boy user or author and for this post it shows update button, right? The same thing here for another post. But what if you want to make it simple by creating something like that is post owner right and i will pass the post then end is post owner here let me delete else currently and yeah something like that to do that we need firstly to go to our app server provider or app service provider here inside app under providers and here is our app service provider file right inside boot method this one we will call our blade class and by calling f method it takes two parameter the first one is the name of directive which is in our case is this one is post owner and the second one is the function callable function here also takes parameter post right and we will return the logic let's identify the type here of post model right and it must return boolean return authenticated user id is the same of post user id right now back again to my code is post owner refresh it may not work because we must remove our view cache here by using php artisan this one php artisan view clear refresh again and i have an error so in my blade we must add end here like end f refresh again and the same result it's more readable and usable i think for example for username if it matches the current authenticated user let's display you instead of username so we can make it easily here right at is post owner then in bold here write you you can also use else and in the end end is post owner don't forget to add at here refresh and now it's usable here is how to create custom directive in laravel support me by clicking on like share and subscribe also i will attach this page link here of the document for learning more about creating custom directives see you in next video